Hello everybody, I am Hardik Patel. Welcome back to Git Tutorial. In this video, I am going to explain one more command which is very helpful in a regular basis. So let's start. So that command name is Cherubic, right? So what that does, what that command does. So basically, in which uh, in that situation, it used it is being useful. Uh, like uh, if you have multiple branches and uh, in in the past if you have committed something which is uh, not in other branches but now in the future or maybe in a uh, after a month you wanted that uh, changes in your branch then you can do this uh, using cherry pick command so let's do that uh, in a practical so you can understand better way right so let's do that so currently i am having uh, three branches master taste conflict example right so let's do that uh, git checkout paste and uh, replace first I'm, I'm making this branch up to date okay now let's see the log last com last command is revert change file right okay now what we will do so why it is auto merging I don't know let me push this branch first to because this is still local branch this is not available on a remote so I have to make it available on the remote okay now you can see that right that was new branch it says what is okay let's go yes here it is right okay now what i'm going to do is uh, i will make one commit here in this branch and that commit we will uh, pull in master branch using cherry pick okay so let's do that so what i'm going to do is adding one line for cherry pick command practical okay I'm saving it and git add txt git commit fm new file is updated. Okay, now this file is updated and now you can see the log here it is available. New file is updated, right? And I'm going to check out again to master branch and you will not see that change, right? So let's do that enter now you can see that the revert change file is there and also file changes is not available now in new.txt only you can see these two lines so now i want that line particular uh, which uh, i committed in uh, taste branch in master branch mm -hmm. so let's do that so first what i have to do is that i need i need that commit id right Again, I have to check out back to taste branch. Then I have to see the log, and I will have to copy this commit ID. Now git check out master. Then git cherry pick and commit ID. Yeah. Okay. Now it is already available in this master branch as well and you can see here the change available so that's how it is easy and you can use uh, in your uh, problems whenever you get this kind of situation you can use it very easily right so that's it uh, thank you very much for watching this video and if you want any more information in uh, re regarding the git you can ask me uh, via comments so just write down the comments in below section until then enjoy git and if you like this video please subscribe my channel and also press bell icon uh, to get notifications okay thank you